today we're back at Spirit Halloween, this time in Marietta, Georgia. This is stop number two on our spooky road trip. Let's go inside and see what their setup's like. All right, here we are again at Reaper's Island. Let's start with Crouchy. I think that's my pattern now. I like starting with him. His laugh just cracks me up. And those teeth. He is one of my favorite clowns. We have a hauntress hiding back here. I see her hiding. Let's see if the step pad works. Maybe? No? Oh, there we go. Yeah, I swear they have that on a delay. For $159.99, there's an Ellie Hatchet. Let's see if she works. She does not. There we go. Oh. I don't know if you heard that, but she actually hit the box. She swung that so hard. And in this store, I don't think she normally is so covered in blood. Like, I don't know if you can see this here, but her hands are covered in blood. And then she has blood like running down her shirt as well. I don't believe it comes that way. So that is pretty cool. Then we have Uncle Charlie here for $209.99. Don't worry. Clown scare me too. <laughs> I love his accent and that laugh. See what else he says. Step right up. The voice to live an hour inside wins a prize. <laughs> and over here we have the Peekaboo Clown for two nineteen ninety nine. I just love hide and seek. One, two, two and a half. Ready or not, here I come. <laughs> His eyes are just so awesome. I wish his mouth was moving here. <laughs> Peek -a -boo! Peek -a -boo! I just love that game, particularly with crying little babies. <laughs> I'm ready to play again. For $199.99, here's the butcher. is pretty cool especially the way he taunts you the last store i was in he had the hatchet in that hand but then he also had a butcher knife down in this hand where you can pose the fingers so i thought that was pretty neat and for 199 here's demonic dahlia look at her hair at this store looks like it's maybe hairsprayed or actually stuck to something over here i can't quite tell <laughs> Now, I like it when they put the hair down in her face like that, and when she jumps up, it kind of flies back. Really creepy. And Johnny Punk. What are you doing, Johnny? I've been waiting for you to come out and play. What took you so long? <laughs> this guy. You made a big mistake coming over here. I'll give you a three-second head start to get lost. One, two, three. Here are the jumping spiders. Let's see if they're set up. Whoa. All right. They definitely got me. These get me every time. They seem like they jump faster than they did in previous years. Here's a Fright in the Box for $209.99. Nice. It's rare to find one of these that actually works the way it's supposed to. So that's really cool. I love the way his laugh echoes as he starts to go back into the darkness. Definitely freaky. And here for $1.99 is Miss Mercy. Listen to that sound. The creaking in her neck is just so creepy. Here's the sewer varmint for $129.99. For anyone who doesn't know, this does hook up to a fog machine. So in that setting, you would have the fog coming out of both mouths here. And it actually looks pretty neat if you've seen it online. 
Here we have the Nightcrawler for $199.99. This guy's quickly becoming one of my favorites. Just for that reason right there. He jumps so high. And then this sway back and forth is so freaky. I might end up getting one of these to go with my Harvester of Souls. I know they don't technically go together, but I think I could I think I could make that work. This is a miserable Marie for $169.99. Oh, she is really loud. I love the way her jaw jiggles. So spooky. Then here we have Angeline for $169.99. That laugh is just so funny. Why do you look so scared? Everyone in the graveyard just wants to be friends. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, just looking at what they have in stock here. It looks like they have Man's Possessed Friend. A couple sewer varmints over here. Demonic Dahlia. There's a couple Miserable Maries. I've never seen this before. It's called the Hanging Hell Fiend. I'm not entirely sure what it does. It says it speaks four menacing phrases. LED eyes light up green, infrared or step pad activated. Don't know. There are some jumping spiders here. Looks like they have the black and browns. And there's also a fright in the box for $104.99. It is broken. I think this is him here sitting next to the box. If what I've seen in other stores is any indication, I imagine it probably does the sound and audio, but it doesn't pop up anymore. That seems to be happening a lot with this guy. They have the Sitting Scarecrow on sale at this store for $99.99. They also have a couple Jack Straws back here as well. Here we have a Reaching Arm Tombstone, which I've seen in previous years. There's a Peekaboo Clown. And then Twisted Tina, who is not an animatronic. She is a prop. But she has a really cool effect if you can get her hanging in the right position. So this is a zombie baby I've actually never seen before. This one is called Snack and Stevie. And he is eating someone's hand. That is really freaky. Look at his face. And look at those teeth. Here's a Pennywise sidestepper I haven't seen in any of the other locations so far. Let's see if I can get him to work. Maybe. There we go. This is my first time seeing these set up in the store. They're not working, but it's still nice to see them on display here. Her eyes are really freaky. And if I step backwards, I think you can see they have some lighting in here as well. So that actually looks pretty cool. For anyone getting excited about election day, they have tons of different Trump and it looks like Biden as well. Candidate masks, Let's see how much these are. $14.99 on that one. $14.99 on that one as well. So yeah, it looks like it might be $14.99 on each of these. So this isn't for sale, but I thought this was awesome. They have this little nook here, I guess from whatever the previous business was, and then they've decorated it with a skeleton with this pirate hat on and the light. I thought that was really neat. Here's another nook they've decorated, and it looks pretty awesome, especially with the red lighting down there. Pretty neat to see them put things on display like this. All right, and that's it for Spirit today. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. It lets me know that I should create more like it and let you know when I post videos in the future. Thanks for watching.